What the fuck, Billy? My arms are tired, Mom. Come on, should we take a break? Her arms are tired. Only five minutes, okay? Look. Ooh. Have you been smoking? No, Mom, it's in the clothes. Wow. Do you know wow. the deal? If you wow. say something, you can't stay on wow. sex. Whatever. Kasha, how do these cuts look? Kasha? Where the hell's a Kasha? Hey! hey. She's making blood right now for you. Jesus, okay, are you alright? If this is one shot, we're done for the day. <laughs> I wish. I still have a 12 to 2 shift at the club tonight. I'll we'll get you there, worry not. Hey, Shane! Do you want to go ahead and get another one? Yeah, okay. Let's get you back in. Okay. And. Action! some dialogue. It's too on the nose. Who says? Someone in the writer's group. Mm, how many scripts has he sold? She. Maybe none, but she talks like she knows a lot. Yeah, well, talk doesn't always equal talent. She says readers will shit can a script if it doesn't have enough white space. <laughs> Not the stupidest thing you've ever heard. I'm gonna make coffee. Do you want today? Yeah. You? Yeah, until five. Do you want to eat all? Can we eat in? Sure. And when you're done venting, keep revising. You're not beautiful when you're rational. That's good. Chloe, sweet sister. What you doing knocking down the door at daybreak? Um, can you give the right to Nelson today? Yeah. All right. I'll hustle up on him. Thanks. I gotta run. Economics is kicking my ass. Plus, I gotta meet with my professor before the test. Good luck. Thanks. Oh, we'll have the rent for you by tonight. Oh, it's no problem. My dad will pay the owner. I can pay him later. Baby is up on the roof. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. She's been up there for a day and a night with no water and no food. Would you please go up there and get her down? Sure, Miss J. I'll save your cat. Okay, put on these gloves. You're gonna need them. And these goggles. Oh, and here's some, here's some oysters. She loves oysters. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. Hey, right. Baby! You got this. You yeah. really got this. No problem, Miss okay. J. Kitty, 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 baby. Here, kitty, 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 kitty. Do you see her? Here, kitty. Uh, no, not she, quite. She's a black cat with with white bib. Baby. Oh, yeah, I see her. What's the look on her face? Uh, vengeance. Dear sir, 
Big House Pictures LLC does not accept unsolicited blah, blah, blah. Hey, what happened? So, it's not your first. I thought we were going to start using these as wallpaper. Come on! You know it's good. You made the finals at the New Orleans Horror Film Festival. You just have to keep sending it in. Why? No one's going to read it. I'm unrepped. What about more festivals? At 50 bucks a pop? Yeah. How's the new piece coming? Well... Enough with the self-pity! Start something new! Anything! I hate seeing you like this. Trust me on pizza? Yeah. Sure. Whatever. Pretty what the hell. I couldn't sit around waiting for Hollywood to call. I knew I had a solid story. I just decided to do it myself. And that's how the main machete master came to be. The rest is they say. <laughs> Chill, bro. What happened? Your able server brother nearly got us arrested. It was not to He's in a fucking red light. This motherfucker took a goddamn tone just when a cop car pulls up. He didn't even look at us. No harm, no foul. You know what? I don't understand. If there's nothing, I damn sure don't want something. That man is long way too tight. Right? And these murderers are gonna be there and they're just gonna kill them off one by The original one. idea was to break as many rules as possible, but still make a movie that people wanted to watch. It was kind of anarchic from the get-go. We call our company Wing Films from Winging It. We wanted to completely throw away the three-act structure. The whole idea of turning points, barriers pushing us into acts. And because we were using our own money. Well, mostly our own money. And because we were shooting mostly with friends. We didn't have to worry about a bunch of suits dictating to us. It was very liberating. <laughs> we can call it virgin. Cheerleaders and <laughs> Can someone get that? Who's coming? Are we expecting guests? <laughs> Excuse me. Whoa, just watch the bong mob. Hey, look who's here! Hey, Nelson! Nakasha? Brian? <laughs> Go up, got the right one. Hey, Chloe! Nice! Hey, guys! Hey. I didn't know they were coming. Sure, you'd want them here. Ryan! Akasha! Hey! Hey, man. hey. It's great What's to up? see you guys! It's been a while, what's been happening? Uh, uh, making ends meet? I don't know. I got a commercial next week. Doing FX for a student film. Well, that's really cool. Yeah. I don't know, man. What about you, right? Like, you've got to be writing something right now. Can't wait till after dinner for the big surprise. Really? Cool. I don't know. Awesome. 
<laughs> hey, how you doing? You alright? Right on, man. Hey, great meal, guys. Oh, oh, thank you. So, good. so yummy. Very really nice. So, what's the big news? Hold on, man. Let me prepare myself for the revelation. <laughs> you told Creature. No, what? What? What then? First, the bad news. I'm not gonna sell Creature. It's a hundred mil project. It's not a sequel or remake or an adaptation. Hollywood won't even read That's it. That's so good. But for the good news, Chloe and I are writing a new screenplay. Virgin Cheerleaders in Chains. Boo <laughs> shakaman! The title alone was sell it. We're not gonna sell it. We're gonna make it. How? With all your help. <laughs> Hell yes. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm in. So ladies and gentlemen, please, raise your glasses. To Virgin Cheerleaders in Chains. To Virgin Cheerleaders in Chains. And to Hollywood? Uh, go fuck yourselves. First impressions? Well, I like it. Good pacing, and I really like that Chloe. I do too. Um, even more than I like Shane. But who's the protagonist? You've got to have a clear protagonist in the first 15 minutes. Uh, I don't think the audience is asking that question. I don't. Hey, you get points for originality. You know, your weird structure. It is that. Shane, if you're going to go all Charlie Kaufman on this, don't confuse us. <laughs> Shane, yeah, man, I'm already lost. Mm -mm. Babe, this does not work for me. Why not? It adds an unnecessary level. The whole point was to go meta. Meta, yes. Meta, meta, no. Besides, it's too self-indulgent. That never stopped QT. We are not QT. Okay. Where are we going for dinner? What are we doing here? What do you think? We're casting. Hey, Morris. Hey, cousin Chloe. Shane, how's it going? <laughs> and it's Mo now. I got Mo of everything. <laughs> um, how is Aunt Mildred? Now she's doing great. Still baking banana bread. I'll have to bring you some. Right. <clears throat> uh, how's the uh, harem? You know, same old, same old. They come, they go. Jessica last week, maybe the week before, I mean, poof, no call, no nothing. Yeah, by the way, I ran into Brian last week, virgin cheerleaders, <laughs> well, that's brilliant. Actually, that's why we're here. Do you have any strippers that have acting experience? Are you kidding me? Every pole dance is a one-woman show. Do you guys believe in serendipity? I guess why. I was on stage. So Amber is a theater major. I gotta go back. So it's a horror film. <laughs> Would you be interested? Yeah, for sure. You've seen my tits? You've heard me scream? Do I get the part? Do I get the part? I oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, she told us Jeez. do I get the part. Just one scream and uh, uh, yeah. What did your dad say? He say he'll match dollar for dollar for whatever money we raise. What? But that fucker's rich like the Donald man. Hey! I'm sorry, man. I, I didn't mean fucker. I meant, like, he's got the money. Yeah, yeah, but he wants commitment. And with commitment, that equals money. Oh, well, this is our guide. We need 8,000 to make something that will get us into festivals. So how can we come up with the other 4,000? <clears throat> Ladies and gentlemen, watch this and be amazed. Four thing to survive. <laughs> we'll get it on YouTube and some crowdfunding sites. Come <laughs> on! Don't you need a script to show investors, though? You would think, but the money comes first, and then we write to our resources. Yeah, investors don't read scripts anyways. Well, shoot some scenes as proof of concept, use that to raise the four, and then it's festival time. Oh, you get a little hit on yourself? Shane tends to do that. 
we were adamant that we were not making a slasher film, no torture porn. Even if we wanted to, which we didn't. No. We can never compete with the Sauer Hostel franchises. So we made the decision early on to limit blood loss. That was the original plan. Uh, as anyone who's seen the movie knows, events sort of conspired to change that plan. Great job, everybody. Damn, Akasha did an amazing job. This looks just like me. Yo, that could be you. <laughs> yeah, it could. Hey, uh, do you think we could use this knife for the next shot? It's not a knife, it's a machete. Hey, guys, let's head out. Akasha's waiting for us at the pub. I'm rock steady ready. Okay, bro. wait, but let's break this all down first. Creepy. I'll, uh, I'll swing by after I drop Amber off at work. Okay. We'll save a pint for you. Yeah. But hurry. Hey, that scream was really good. Yeah. Okay, you guys, yeah. I'm um, Yeah? Yeah, I got the cops call on me by Holy my crap. Know. You know, it, it's really that scary. I thought someone was dying earlier. I really did. Thank and you. clearly someone died. <laughs> so. Hey, Where were you? I'm rest for a ride after a shift. Should I be worried? No. Don't, don't worry. Son, and no, I do not have the obscure fucking vulgar and horror classic that only you and a couple of your friends know about. Well, I'm doing okay myself, but I'm not here to rent. Speaking of classics, Chloe and I watched them three last week. <laughs> well, thank you. I'll get a few pennies for that. So, what brings you in? Chloe and I are writing a new script. That's cool. We're wondering if you might like to help. I kind of had you in mind for a part. What's the part? Um, play yourself, Mike Bill. You'd even have a shop just like this. A horror movie? Is there another kind? What's your budget? <clears throat> 8,000. For a feature. 85 pages, 90 minutes with the end credits. That ain't low. That's a no. Gotta be deferred payments. Is that a percentage? So you need me for distribution? Can't deny it. But look, the story needs you. In fact, it can't work without you. Don't bullshit me, Shane. I'm not. Serious as a corpse. All right. I'll look at it. This ain't 85 pages. It's, uh, work in progress? Huh. Okay, Dad. I understand. I'll tell him. Bye. Okay, so I've got this great idea. What happened? Who died? My dad is backing out. Why? He can't come in without a script. Then we'll give him one. Shane, do you know where this thing is going? Because I sure don't. I know I have a third act. Mm. Sort of. And I just found the person we need for it. Mike Bill. The man. The legend. Machete Mike? I believe he just busted our non-existent budget. He's in for a percentage. Plus, here's the kicker. He's got our third act location for us. Hey, are you sure you know where we're going? Just following Mike's directions. Yeah, well, we haven't seen a house in miles. I grew up in country like this. I love it. Surely you just... I'm not. It's beautiful. Fresh air, quiet. And don't call me Shirley. What'd you do for fun? I took long walks, oh. played with my dogs, swam the pond, and read like crazy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, really? What? You don't think strippers can read? That is so sexist, Nelson. Technically, it's only sexist if only thought male strippers can read. I used to read, bud. 
That's it. I think we're lost. I'm calling Mike. Shit. Still no cell perception. Mike said it might be spotty. Okay, I give up. Let's just go home. We definitely need a location manager. Mm -hmm. Get something. Get something. <laughs> How's it going? It's going. It's cool. It's cool, man. It's like arts and crafts class. <sighs> dun, 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 dun. What do you think? What is it? Our poster. You're getting ahead of yourself again. My father will always say. You're putting the cart before the horse. Horses, carts. Nelson, you need to drag your butt to the 21st century. It means. I know what it means. Wait. No, man. I think Nelson's right. You got to put the horse before the cart. How's our fundraising coming along? We raised 1700 Yes, 2300 more and we're a go. 2300 and a script. Remember what Nelson's dad said. I'm thinking. I'm thinking, what if we did a fundraiser? Chloe, your boss, Angela, she's in the band, right? Yeah. Think she'd do a benefit for us? I'm not gonna ask. And Nelson, if we can set it up, get your dad to come. Yeah, I guess. Hey, Mr. Businessman, how's it going? Damn good, check this out. We sold 80 tickets online. Uh, not too many people sold up, but we did get a lot of money. Thank you, sir. How much? 16, 20. Yes, all right. Yes. Minus the expenses for the club. Enough with the expenses, man. Let me enjoy 1600 All right, all right. Hey, is your dad here? Yeah, he's in the restaurant. Okay. Oh, oh, just so you know, Billy walked in there earlier and did not want him near my dad. He's pretty fucked up, so. Okay. Just be careful. We've got a location set, so we pretty much have the movie. We can make it, and we can sell it, with your help, of course. I like your plan, uh, but you have to write it before you make it, and until I see a script, all I can give you is my best wishes. A what? A script? Okay. Ambitious! Ambitious wins! Guys, we are called Super 8. This next song is called Karma. So you better watch it out there. We're gonna bring it down. We're gonna show it around. Oh, and oh, I don't know that it's gonna be fine. Yes. Yes. Oh my gosh. Fantastic set, Angela. Really. Thank you so much. You guys are Thank awesome. You. I mean, play it loud. Yeah. <laughs> We like to do that, that's for sure. <laughs> okay, I'll see you guys on set, okay? Yeah. You guys were awesome. I don't know how we're going to repay you. Did you not tell him? Angela wants to be on the crew. Oh my gosh, thank you. Sweet, what do you want to do? Well, I've done location scouting before, so I thought maybe I could go to the property early and handle the catering or sleeping quarters. It would be totally awesome. There's one catch, though. What's that? I'd like my band to be in the movie. Of course. Totally. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, I don't do that. She doesn't do that. Stupid. He's okay when he's when he's not smoking. I mean, come on, the, the man reeked of pot. Yeah, and Shane and Chloe, what? The guy who works at a taco shack, and what does she do? Yeah. Oh yeah, sells popcorn at the multiplex. Yeah, cut them some slack. They were English majors. And you're a semester away from an MBA, and I'm going to finish it. I just, I just think they're onto something, and I want to be part of it. I'll give producer credit. Your name and lights. That's what it's all about, right? Don't let it blind you, son. Dad, I won't. I, I, I promise. Focus on the finish line. I will. But will you still help us? Not without a script. And a good one at that. Sugar? You know I don't take sugar. $4,200. Yes! 
What did your dad say? He still wants to see a script. Come on now, you say it yourself. Let's give him one. Yeah, well, we, what if we could? I've never had writer's block this bad. Well, let's just throw some shit down. Maybe he won't even read it. Oh no, he'll read it all right. He has a highly trained shit detector. Well, how far into the script are you? We almost have a midpoint. Do, but you say we had a third act. Depends on how you define have. I'm afraid we're gonna have to do something I never wanted to do. Hey man, somebody call about a refrigerator? Anyone call for maintenance? Yeah, I'm on. So glad you can make it. I'm Billy. Tom, Tom Kendall. It's my friend Nelson. Nice to meet you. How you doing? Whoa. Well, we're not many this way. Y'all know what the hell uh, Billy was talking about. Something about the Xbox? Well, yeah, let's have a look here, see what we can find. Hmm. What I thought. Phone's ringing. Shane, can you hand that for me? Thanks. Hello? Hey. Yes, sir. It's a real common problem this time of year. The little filter here, it'll, it'll stop up and shut the whole freezer down. Just about every six months or so, take it out of here, clean it up, pop it back in place. Bob's your uncle. What do we owe you? Nada. Now I'll send a bill to Westgate Management. You say, uh, are you guys filmmakers or what? Yeah, no shit. Well, we will be. We're in pre-production right now. Hell, man, I'm an actor. Yeah. Hell, tell me about your film. Of course. <laughs> mm. Listen, man, I tell you, man, I'd really, really like to be part of this now. I, I, hell, I don't mind deferred pay at all. I'm a hell of an actor. Give me that showreel. We don't have our bad guy yet. Well, I tell you what, man. You need somebody to chain up virgin cheerleaders? <laughs> but I'm your man, buddy. Oh, God, it's time flies when I'm drinking beer. I got a book. Okay. I'll get you that reel, though. <laughs> is that Tom the Refrigerator guy? Mm-hmm. He is good. I'm cheap, too. I'm gonna meet with him tomorrow. I miss this. Me too. You have a cool one today. Yeah? Yeah, someone, some guy used on Amber at the club. He said, how about some honey for some money? Wow. Really know how to kill a moment. What? I mean, you don't know. I just thought it was a cool line. We could have a scene where she's leaving the club. What is it with you two? What do you mean? I mean that you're spending more time with her than with me. Her car's in the shop. Besides, she's got some good story ideas. Oh yeah? Does she keep them right here? Because that's all I ever see looking at. Come on, you know I like small boobs. <sighs> wow. You did not just say that. No, I didn't. I, I, I mean, I, I did, but, but I, I, didn't, I didn't mean... You know what I mean. I'm gonna go downstairs. I'm meeting with Angela, giving her directions. She wants to go out to the house today. I left a list of things we need on the computer. Can we talk? I love you. Are you sure you don't want any? No, 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 no. Don't let me have any, please. Ugh. I hate that this is happening. You don't know that this is happening. I think I know that this is happening. Well, did you ask him? Yes. He said that I have nothing to worry about. I probably have nothing to worry about. Why do I have this bad feeling? Look, even if he, if he's attracted to her, it's not gonna last. How do you know? My husband looks at women all the time. Most men look at women all the time. It's, it's in their genes, they can't help it. Doesn't mean he's gonna do anything about it. A lot of men do. Well, a lot of men are dirty, filthy pigs. <laughs> <laughs> Shane, Shane loves you. 
He really does. Thanks, Angela. For what? For listening. Eat your ice cream. <laughs> hey, how's the house? Yeah, so we tried to find the place. We even have directions, but we still couldn't find the house. You couldn't find the house? Well, that's why you need me. It's right out there by the 420 and 22. There's a Y, there's a huge cow polka dots on it. <laughs> no clue. <laughs> Listen, this is why you hired me. I'm your location scout. I'll go up there right now, and I'll tell you when I get there. Okay? Done. You were lucky. Not everyone was. No question, it was a killer shoot. Sure. We're still ready. Oh, yeah. Hey, we can use mine. Bushaka! I think we have all that we need. Yeah, well, we're definitely gonna use this. Why? Oh, what the fuck, dude? What the fuck? Oh, my God. Jesus Christ! What the fuck? What the hell? Oh, my God. What the hell? Cool. Cool, cool man. You got cool. me. That's childish. Let me see this thing. Grow up, guys. Fuck you! What do you want to say to your friends? Go! Go! Please, go! Fuck you! Fuck you! No! <laughs> I still can't get a hold of Angela. We know the service is crappy there. Yeah, but she sent this weird text that just said, don't. That can mean almost anything. Are we still going up there? Yeah, we're, uh, we're meeting here at three. Then where I go? My uh, indie guidebook says, if there's a problem with production, work around it. Make it the character's problem. Fuck you! Let's do this, guys. Come on, guys, we're losing light. We got time.
right, we're locked and loaded. Okay, everybody, let's go wrap this movie. Oh, Captain, my Captain. <laughs> Started in the film department you're in. Oh, I know. I follow your career. You know, it's funny. I always joke with my friend Julie, who's here, that if I were in any kidnapping situation, I would get Stockholm syndrome with you. Oh, get yeah. it up, Billy. <laughs> hey, you dropped your knife. It's not a knife. It's a machete. Okay, everybody, let's get inside. We need to organize. We're filming later. Here. I was going to ask you. She never showed. I'm sure she's all right. Probably got hung up somewhere. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just couldn't help myself. Y'all wouldn't even be here if it wasn't for this movie. Made Mike here famous. Mike, say grace. Our Father, Bless this food which we accept from your bounty with humility and gratitude. And bless our guests from the big city. And help us to show them the time of their lives. Amen. Amen. And one more thing. No humans were harmed in the making of this. Sausage. <laughs> Namaste, y'all. Namaste. Shave room for dessert. We're having fresh rhubarb pie. Get away, Tom. What? Not you, the dogs. Oh, Mr. Fish, they're beautiful. Well, thank you, dear, but I don't know how they got out. Otto, come get these dogs. I'm sorry, Mr. Fish. Come, Tom, hurry, come. They seem well-behaved. Do you train them? To do what? Oh, you know, like, do they mind you? Let me answer that. You just saw Tom and Harry. They had a brother, Dick, up until a couple of months ago. I was shaven with my own straight razor as usual. Damned if I didn't go and cut myself. I looked at Dick. He snarled at me, preparing to leave. Stay, Dick, stay. He jumped at me, and I had to gut him with my razor. Wow. So, to answer your question, yeah, they will mind me as long as they don't smell any blood. You a dog person? Yeah, I love dogs. And they love me. Bitch in heat. I'm sorry? I said I'd pinch my hip. You wouldn't pinch your hip if you got out of that chair more often. 
feet so you can walk? Hell yeah, you can walk. I can get around a little, maybe to the door and back. The doctors say I have some kind of nerve condition. You got lazy eyes, what you got. You're a harsh taskmaster, Mike. Speaking of tasks, who's on kitchen duty? Yeah. Guess I am. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm so bald. <laughs> Go! So many pig's feet. Not ready to pickle yet. <laughs> I thought that smelled familiar. My grandma used to make pig's feet. Let's take out the kitchen now. This old man is going to bed. Oh, thank you for dinner, Mr. Fish. Yes, thank, thank, you so Mike. thank Mike, he did the cooking. Thank, thank you, it's really good. Thank you, Mike. Don't forget to turn on the fence. Don't know what good it does. Depends on the back of the hole you could drive a tractor through. Turn on the fence? We had to electrify it. it keeps the drunken teens from town out and other critters. Hey, what's that shed out there for? <clears throat> That's Uncle Al's inner sanctum. It's where he keeps his, uh, collections. Oh. What does he collect? Stuff. All safe now. Hey, so where is everybody anyway? We're setting up for this scene. And one more thing. After the shoot, don't go wandering around. Easy to get lost. 78 Alpha, take one. Damn it, Billy. What's it up? All right, last one. Last one. Uh, okay, what scene is this? Everybody. This, 78. 78. This is our all is lost moment. Okay. Ginger, Julie, you're both dead. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's what you want to Really see. great dead pickle in rehearsal, by the way. Fantastic. All right, I'm in the middle, obviously. And I still have some fight left in me. I know that Tom's going to come through that door at any moment. Jeez, Mike. Okay, all right. Mike, thank you. Okay, so Tom's going to come through that door at any moment. Okay, we, we ready to go? Yes, I will. Right. Be ready. Make sure you your lines, okay? All right, guys, we're going to get rolling. All right, love it. Yeah, all right, guys, we're set. That's my boot and action. Cut! It's a cut. Yeah, yeah. 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 pretty good. Yeah, yeah, I like it. I think it looks awesome. The lighting was phenomenal. Always a good idea. Yeah, thank you. How was that? Um, okay. I want to do okay, it. Okay, it looks fantastic. Just to be safe, we're going to do it. Yeah, we'll do a reverse and uh, then we're going to break for that, okay? Yeah, it's like, I'm I feel like we can uh, we can let them all rest and then we'll talk later in the library. Sure. Yeah, done. Yeah, sure. Do you guys want to see the playback? Yeah. Jesus, Mike, how hard did you put this on? Oh, down, Mom. Oh. <laughs> hey. Hey. Oh, this is a nice place for a creepy house. Yeah, I like it. It's a nice bed, too. Really nice bed. Nice bed. Do you want to try out the bed? I, mm, I do want to try the bed. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, I need to go downstairs. Shane needs me right now. Oh. Yes. Does Shane need me? Mm. I need you. No, Shane Shane doesn't need you now. Later. It's easy stuff like cuts and bruises. Snap for you. Okay. <laughs> so fool yourself. <laughs> well, hey. So, I'll see you down in a little bit, though, right? Yeah. I'm just going to, like, take a shower and maybe walk around a bit. Okay. Yeah. Watch out. <laughs> you realize we have no backstory for this house. So, yeah, how about this? This is a home for unwed mothers, okay? Because um, back then, getting knocked up out of wedlock was like, you know, a badge of shame and shit. So, parents send their daughters here um, to raise kids, and then, like, you know, while they're away, they just tell the neighbors they're at Europe or something. What happened to the kids? I don't know, they grow up. Doesn't matter. It's a one line fix. I hate exposition. Do you think these dolls are haunted by the ghosts of the kids who died here? Absolutely. It's This room is so freaking creepy. It was right here. Actually, I saw in one of those ghost shows that dolls are vessels for human spirits. You've been watching way too much TV. <laughs> really? Yeah. Seriously, though, if I had known we were going to be sleeping in the children of the corn bedroom, I would have brought more Xanax. This is so cool. By cool, you mean creepy. Nope, an actual movie. Like a real thing. A feature. And with Mike Beal. <laughs> hey, why can't we see a script? <laughs> what script? Look, just be glad you ladies took those improv classes. 
Okay. Yeah. You got it. Did you not take those improv classes? I took like three hours. It was amazing. I was amazing. Professor got me high up back. Was I going to say no? Okay. You know what? I'm going to go take care of something. You guys have fun. Be right back. Wait. What are you guys going to do while I'm gone? I'll think of something. Definitely. Sure you will. Be good. We will. I want that main machete mask for mask. You think Billy and Nelson will help us? Of course they will. Come in. Hey. Shane isn't here. He and Brian are going over scenes for tomorrow. I didn't come to see Shane. Um, can I come in? Sure. So what are you doing? Just reworking some dialogue. Yeah. <laughs> Cause I mean, there are screens and then there are screens. What is it you wanted to talk about? I wanted to clear up any misunderstandings. Like what? Like that I'm interested in Shane. Uh, well, maybe you should tell him that. I will, but I wanted to tell you. Okay. Okay. Remember how I told you I was raised in country like this? Yeah. My grandparents raised me. I was homeschooled. And the only other kids my age were these two sisters that lived on a farm nearby. And at night we would sneak out and go skinny dipping. And, um, we would have a lot of fun. If <laughs> you know what I mean. No. I'm making you uncomfortable. No, no, you're, you're not making me uncomfortable. Chloe, I never developed any interest in boys. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Man, you could have fooled Shane. Holy cow. When he first saw you at the strip club, he was like, boing. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I kind of get that a lot from men. <laughs> Hazards of the job. Women do, though. I'm making you uncomfortable. No, 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 no. No, you, you're not making me uncomfortable. You've read Henry James, right? Yeah, sure. Turn of the screw. You know how he says, be one for whom nothing is lost. He loves you so much. Surely you know that. I know. And don't call me Shirley. <laughs> <laughs> my life. <laughs> hey guys, we shouldn't be in here. What are you afraid of, Nelson? I'm not afraid of anything. I'm just saying. No, Nelson's a good little boy scout. Always see how coming straight to nail. You should, uh, open up a bit. Oh, you got any smoke? No, I swore off the herb till the end of the rap party. Right, bro? Scoot? The hell no. It was worth the try. Come on, let's check out the area. Check out this oven. Oh man, you could bake so many goodies in here. <laughs> right? What was that noise? Is this still on? Why would Mr. Fish need something so big? I don't know, let's find out. It's locked. Yeah, well, I learned a few things in prison. You were in prison? No, but that seems to make sense. Just open. Why are you trying to fight right there? 
cousin's mask. Can we just go make out something? Because it's my cousin's mask. For the name of Shitty Mascara Films, it's an original prop. <laughs> we Scooby Sam. Scoops. <laughs> okay, this is it. Ready? Oh my god. <laughs> Nelson and Billy upstairs. Uh, he's got them cornered. He's got the bloody knife. How do we get these guys back downstairs? Doesn't matter. We'll fix it later. Ah! Shit, my glasses. I twisted my ankle. Let's go. You go, man. I'll, I'll hold him back. I think you want to pass this. I am, but I don't think he is. Let's go. Go. Come on. Jump. Come on. Come on. You got this. Come on, Billy. Mike said that he collects stuff. You want to go find out what stuff? That sounds stupid enough. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> Ooh, nothing makes me feel fresh and new as a shame in a shower, I'm yeah. telling you that. You look at the bathroom? Uh huh. Well, then you go to the top of the steps, then you go left, you go right. Okay, thanks. Right? Yeah. All right. I do not like cutting that volleyball scene, right? But, um, it's time, it's money, and we're running low on both. I know, I know, but what's a slasher movie without sexy girls playing volleyball? And we're losing that great line. Get it up! Get it up! Yeah. Well, you know what they say. Sometimes you have to kill your little darlings. <laughs> Quit flopping around like that. You don't hurt yourself. <laughs> <laughs> well, what did I found? Look, I found your little friend. <laughs> Man, I thought I'd lost that one. Yeah, I thought I'd lost you, little fella. <laughs> what the fuck was that? You hush that screaming up now. You save that for later. You're gonna need a lot of screaming later. Damn it, don't sneak up on me. You scared the shit out of me. I ain't through playing with this one yet. Hold on, let me get a damn souvenir. 
Tiffany Blood Feast. Hannah, the Gore Gore Girls. Robin's first thing there. It's a funny name. Shit. I think these are snuff films. No, that's an urban legend dancer. This is from a commercial board in Louis City. This is not real. Hi girls, I'm Tasha with great idea for a seat. What's it? If I cut the power, you can go out and go for help. I'm not leaving you here. Just go. No. Like we've got a blown fuse. I can give you a lot more pleasure alive than dead. Oh, I bet you can. Open that top and let's see what we got to play with. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, darling. You got the three things I look for most in a woman. Yeah. What's that? Obedience and perky tits. <laughs> I don't think that that would be a good idea after your last little stunt. Oh, you know I didn't mean anything by it. Let me make it up to you, huh? <laughs> How's that zipper coming, baby? Real good. Where the hell is 
is everybody? What do you want to do? I want to get the fuck out of here. I guess I have to get you first. that all is lost feeling? That's where your movie has to go, right? It sucks, by the way. It looks painful. Shit! Oh, God, stop! What? Where, where are the others? Where are the others? Some of them are right here. I have to leave you for a minute, Shane. But you can watch one of my home movies while you wait. See if you recognize the middle lane. These on. The fuck is this? Virgin cheerleaders and chains. The movie. We're not virgins. You ain't cheerleaders either. But you will be in chains. Help! 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 You guys gotta help! You guys gotta help! They're killing everybody! Please! Whoa there, young fella! Who's killing who? Back at the house to kill everybody. You guys gotta help. Drink your blood. Some of it. Have you been smoking? No, man. It's in my clothes. No, you guys. Check I had to kill a dog. Nelson got caught in a bear trap. Oh God, Nelson. Explain this. I'm saving that for the rap party. Well, rapper boy, explain to the judge on Monday. What? No, it'll be too late. It'll be too late. They'll all be dead by then. You guys gotta help them out. No. no. Girls are ready for prime time. Mike, are you there? Yes, I'm here. What do you want? I want to know what the fuck is happening. When I find out, I'll let you know. Huh? I said I'll let you know when it's time. Then get a move on. God damn it. I will. God damn you. 
Feels be good now. like my movie? I know. Crappy production values. I'm surprised you didn't figure it out. A repairman who just happens to be an actor? Coincidence? I think not. I sent Tom to you, Shane. I manage Farrell's properties. <laughs> now, I'm going to take your mind off of that pain. But like any good doctor, I want to explain what I'll be doing. <laughs> I'll make an incision, right? <laughs> Stop it, my God! These <laughs> movies never show. It's how the intestines <laughs> explode. <laughs> I've been the opening down there. <laughs> there's so much pressure. Don't fuck my boy, you're doing this! Um, let me see. How about this? I'm a psychopathic sadist. Is that good? <laughs> it's time to get to work. I can start without Tom. Just like in your movie, which I don't see getting into any film festivals, a small difference. I'm here. Hello, little girl. Where's Shane? He's back in the shed with Mike, making a new movie for my collection. It's a closed set. Why are you doing this? Killing is a lot more fun when you make a game out of it. It's not a game. Don't you know better than to bring a knife to a gunfight? It's not a knife. It's a machete! <laughs> Jesus, I have way too many machetes. Don't be such a pussy, Shane. I made that cut on dozens of women and have a loss for two. Which, they all scream just like you, by the way. You ready? It's gonna sting a little bit. No, 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 no! Get away from him, you twisted fuck! Wow! Chloe to the rescue! Man, you can make a young Ripley. I'll be fair. <laughs> you bastard! Oh, please. I just choked her out. This is going to be fun. Leave the gun. 
get the camera. And cut! It's a wrap! <laughs> Yeah.